Hello, Killzone tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem, The Binding Blade, with me, Linko. So, we've, uh, started chapter... Chapter... Eight. That's the chapter. We're on eight. And, uh, you know, we started down here, fought our way up, and then over, had some more friends arrive, and bust down a wall, and now we've got three more dudes. Say hello to Barth, Oldger, and, uh, Wendy. Pretty cool. But now we've got a... Perhaps a difficult area to fight through, we'll see. Um, they got a lot of units, and they've got some mages that are going to be throwing fireballs or whatever across the uh, the wall at us, so we've got to be a little bit careful. Lance already took one, so now we've got to destroy this mage. So I'm thinking... Probably safe to use, like, Shanna in this situation if we wanted to. She can do it if she hits twice, so why not let her? This is what we pay her for. She's supposed to kill mages. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I know, guys. So if uh, Shanna can't do it, Sue can totally do it, right? Just check positioning. I can put her beside Shanna safely. And surely... She wouldn't miss, would she? Surely. Right. Okay, done. So now, what I'd like is to like lure maybe like just these two up first on their own. So someone like Barth could maybe stand here and maybe that'll lure one of these guys up so that we can start, you know, start just teaching them what life's all about. We'll heal up Shanna and, uh, Lance. We'll move Lance over this way. Just so we've got more space for the rest of the team, basically. Not too sure if Wendy's going to be very useful here, but we'll see. Maybe. Deke is always useful. Roy's been kind of falling behind a little bit. Same with Luff. Oh, you know, technically, because we've got the longbow, um, Sue could have shot this guy from uh, three tiles away here. That would have been cool. Don't forget, we have to rescue Lelina here. Uh-oh! It's that thief! So now we're going to have to deal with Kath again. Okay, good. So they are sort of taking the bait and sort of moving towards us now. Now, I do really like Barth's armor. Uh, I gotta say, he's the, the the most stylish of all armor knights in a Fire Emblem game. So I appreciate that. Alright, so let me think here. So we need to get into this room before the thieves get there, or we're in trouble. Now I think we could steal this lockpick from that thief. Maybe even the, uh, uh, well, you probably just get a vulnerary from Kath if we steal it. But if we if we steal the lockpick before we kill the thief, that might be worth, that might be valuable. Oh yeah, we need to make a, a pretty aggressive push here or else we're gonna go too slowly. So. One good thing is that this mage is no longer guarding this wall, so he's not gonna like- I was thinking he might go up for, for Alan, right? But he, he decided to go the other way. So start with the people the furthest away. Uh, Luf does not have very many options. So he just finishes this guy. Could have tried to feed somebody some XP here, but honestly right now, we just need to get as many kills as possible this round. Wendy has very little options as well, um, she's also not particularly strong, so I don't know, I don't know if I'm going to keep her. I think it's going to take a lot of work to level her up. We have the same kind of problem with, uh, Barth in that he can't move very far and he's got no accuracy. 
It was a good, good lucky hit there, but can't count on 57%. If I gave him an Iron Lance, he'd have better chance. Definitely would have a better chance. Um, kind of want to use Sue on the Mage, because not a lot of people are going to be able to even hit the Mage. It's not going to kill it though. What about Steel? Ah, it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a gamble, you know. Oh, we only get one hit at Steel Bow, so she's she's not. She's not strong enough to use the Steel Bow twice yet. Okay. So I'd have to hit someone else with a... With a range 2 attack would have to be... Yeah, I don't know what the odds are going to look like here. Let's have uh, Rutger here finish off the archer, just to make the movement a little bit easier for uh, the cab getting around the archer. Yeah, okay. That's what Mermidens tend to get level ups on. Too slow. Probably not going to be able to kill all these guys. And we could try throwing a hand axe. It's good damage, but only 56%. What about against the, uh... Knights? So are we going to be able to even kill any knights is the question. Ah, uh, it's going to be pretty hard to even kill one of them, I think. That's only one attack. You get a double at 6, 12 damage maybe. Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll open with this. Hopefully we don't miss or anything. Maybe get a lucky dodge. Good. I was thinking if he did get hit, we'd still have the option to, uh, to heal him with uh, our Troubadour. So then it brings us down to Lance, who needs to do a double as well. To be with a steel lance. We can't get any more. Ah, dang it. So we can't get any higher hit rate. Oh, double miss lance. Disappointing. Mediocre. Alright. That was a little bit less good. Can we still kill it, maybe? It's not enough damage. Not super happy about leaving Shanna right here though. She'd probably die. Not great. Definitely not great. So. I don't really have any other options though. Shoot. Yeah, that definitely didn't go quite the way I was planning. I don't think I can kill this knight, because we missed twice in a row. If I hadn't missed twice in a row, Sue could have taken him out. But as it is, her best is 8 damage. That's 12 damage on its own. That's 18 if they both... Well, that'll probably both hit. But that's not enough to kill the mage. Uh, we could... 67 is probably better than the hand axe. Yeah. Alright, well here's, here's my idea. We're gonna do this, then we're gonna try to rescue Sue out of the way. Oh, never mind. We got a crit. Thanks, Sue. So my plan was to do that and then have somebody, like maybe Deke, rescue her, and then I could use either Shanna or Lot to try again and uh, make sure we get the kill there. So that was definitely a little bit of luck. Are any of these guys javelins? None of them are javelins. I don't think she's just strong enough to... 
We do a lot of damage to this guy, but we couldn't kill him. We pretty much have to heal up um, Lance, just in case he gets doubled here. Okay, I think what we do then is we put Shanna here. Just leave her with an Lance equipped. She can only be attacked once. Lance can only be attacked once. Alan could be attacked twice, but he should be fine. And then we just need more people for next turn, and we, we should have it now. We should be fine. Gotta get our thieves moving down too here quickly. All right. Well, I think we're fine. Um, didn't go quite perfect, but that lucky critical at the end there really saved my butt. All right, you're gonna go after Shanna. 28% and you got a hit. Now if she kills him, she might be in trouble, but at least she did not kill him. <laughs> Should have equipped like the uh, Slim Lance, so she did less damage. <laughs> because if she killed him, then that spot would have been open for someone else to move in. That would have been really bad. So I expect the other one will be going after Alan as well then. No? Well, how convenient they decided to split their attacks up. Pretty bad news for that guy. Yeah, strength and speed. Good stuff. All right, we don't have too many more turns before they get to the treasure room. So we're gonna wanna like open this lock this turn and start moving people in so we can block the inside up if we need to. Let's make sure this guy dies. Number one priority. That's a pretty good level up for Luff. For Fluff. Just wanna see. No, she can't even hurt him. So. Just let Deke deal with them. He'll need a bit of healing, but. Well, he may need some healing, that is to say. But I think he's got it. Cool! It will be nice to have two mages, um, just a little bit more armor. A little bit more ability to deal with armor. possible one of the mages will attack um, across the wall. So I'll send... Oh, I didn't heal her! No, no, no. Can they actually hit her? Okay, she's actually safe, but that was silly. I should not have done that. Alright. I forgot to check her HP before. Thought I just wasted my Pegasus. Oh, you gotta be smart, Blue. You gotta be smart. All right, Chad, get in there. Start looting. Ooh. Imbued with magic. So these guys will do magic damage rather than physical damage, which means a lot of enemies like those knights that have high physical defense but no magic resistance get wrecked. Pretty rare weapon. Kind of want to make sure uh, Ellen's down, or Saul, that is to say, is down this way to heal Chan up. Hmm. If he never gets any strength up, or magic up, that is to say, he's not going to be a very powerful, um, whatever his promotion is, bishop or something, whatever it is. Older. Oh, I sure hope you're not, like, going to kill her. Because I couldn't get here much quicker. <laughs> that would be very rude if they've come to kill. I 
feel like I've been rushing pretty well. Well, uh, Shanna, good luck. Hey, Elfire. Now, I don't want to actually kill Kath for reasons. We don't want to kill her. I kind of want to block her in, though. And I do want uh, Roy to catch up there. Can we get hit? We could get hit through this area. But, like, only once, so it's probably fine. Actually, um... If you want to fight, fight Luf like that. That'd be great. We'll send uh, the knights through the uh, safer passage, I guess. All right. Well, good luck, Lalina. All right. So you did go for the attack. Got the dodge and just a miss. All right. Well, fine, fine. I think Luf, putting Luf here was a good idea, though. Yeah, he's gonna make short work of the mages. I guess I could have tried, uh, or still could try, uh, Sue, actually. Oh, now they're running away. I would, I was really hoping we'd get that lockpick, but I don't know, I don't think we'll be able to catch them. I also, I really need to talk to Kath here, actually, so... I need to block her in. Can't worry about dealing with that second thief. We just need to make sure she can't escape. So, this way she can't get anywhere. Roy should be close enough for next turn. Sue! Let's hold off on that unless we need it. It's not a very good attack. Let Luff kill another one, I guess. He's already level 10, right? Yeah, he doesn't even really need the XP per se, but... It's probably the easiest way to deal with all the, the, uh, the mages guarding this room, actually. Those are good. One of the few reasons to bring a normal archer that upgrades into a sniper is they, uh... I think they also get the critical bonus as a sniper. But, uh, otherwise those classes are pretty bad, I feel. Another promotion item. So... If Alan gets hit back, he'll take 12 damage. Worst case scenario, he actually could... Like, worst case scenario, just imagine this me. He shoots, he throws a javelin, hits. Does not kill the mage. The mage counters, hits, does 12 damage. Next turn, the mage uses fire, hits him again, another 12 damage. He's down to one. He counters, he kills it! Great! But then, another mage... This one moves up and does another 12 damage. Suddenly he's dead. So we can't really attack. Just because worst case scenario. Now we could try with Sue, but... I guess if she hit 8 damage, then his attack would be enough to kill it. But still, like, I don't like it. I just, I think that's too risky. We'll just wait a little bit longer. Oh, is that thief gonna go for this treasure? Oh, snap. A 
That's going to be difficult to stop. Well, we're going to just have to rush a little bit here, I guess. Would have been much better if we'd caught this thief heading into this room and then killed him or stole his, uh, his stuff. Just stole his stuff. Probably not worth it. Might do a little bit of damage, but... Let's talk to Kath first. It's you! Yeah, says the guy that has two thieves working for him. Sometimes. Look, she's no Robin Hood. Some of the marquees are pretty bad, though, I'll, we'll admit. The Lycian League is not as noble as they'd like you to think. You're not going anywhere. Nah, she can leave if she wants. Also, by the way, you've been rescued by the thieves, actually. There we go. Let's not put Shanna in the danger zone. Well, those are my fastest units down there that would try to catch that thief. I don't know how that's going to work. Maybe what I can do is leave, like, the mage over here, like, Urk. Not Urk, you know what I mean. And, uh, if the thief heads up this way, maybe we'll just try to kill him with magic? I don't know. I feel like I may have bollocksed it a little bit by, um, not catching that second thief. So many people on this map just moving slowly one turn. Come on guys, hurry up. Auto move. Alright, he took the bait. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What? So... So, that, that happens. Uh, I was not expecting a random knight to have a killer lance that could just one shot I should have checked, but, you know, every other knight on the maps had an iron or a steel or a javelin. Oh, fire emblem. Fire emblem. I should have gone through all the enemies like this, making sure. Air Calibur is kind of cool. But, um, how would you have just guessed that this guy would have a killer lance and be able to one-shot somebody? I'm probably gonna redo this chapter now. Dang it! Well, hold on, hold on. When I started the episode, see, I put a save here, so technically I can just reload from here. Um, dang it! Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut the video here. I'll come back probably at the same point. I'll try to catch that thief. Uh, differently so that he doesn't escape next time anyway because I was kind of mad about that But I'll you know we'll just break same thing as what we've done for today's episode I'll try to redo 
and then I'll meet you guys back here, and I'll recognize that maybe the killer lands is a problem. That was, that was just so cheap. I could keep going with Lance dead, but I mean... He was like level 9 as well, and he was definitely one of the better Cavaliers. You know, like, I feel like if I let someone die... There has to be a reason for it, not just because the enemy got a cheap crit. Because they had a weapon they shouldn't have had. Oh well. I'll be back, we can talk about it in the comments later. I'll see you guys in a minute. Or, well, for you, just a second.